tutorial, I'm going to show you how to reorder some products. I'm using aquagrade.com as the example on this. Um, now, the products are actually in the order that we want them to be um, after we change them, but I'm going to show you exactly how we go ahead and edit them. So for this example, I'm going to go into my uh, back end in WP Admin, and I'm going to go over to products. Now, when you're in products, customizing the order of these, there's actually a little link up here. It's a little bit hidden sometimes. Uh, and it says sort products. So in sort products, you'll see that you have these, this uh, cross area thing. You can actually drag and drop. Now, one of the things that made uh, this a little bit difficult at first is that I have my screen options up here and when everything's selected, you can see that everything's really big because it's SEO plugin. So how I fix that is I actually just went over here and remove the ones that are really causing an issue. So I have it <clears throat> as like a way I can drag and drop. Now, let's go back to our products and see uh, we have a countertop versus osmosis system in here and uh, we want that to be first, but then let's move this so it's third. Now, it automatically saves automatically. Now, I'm gonna refresh this and it won't work. I'll show you why. You can see that it's the same order. Now, uh, this is because when we go into our settings, which we go over to WooCommerce, let me go to settings, and then you go to products, so you click on the products tab, you can go over and see the default order, uh, default product sorting is set to most recent. Now, the default ones, this might not be a problem for all of you. Uh, the default sorting algorithm is this one. Now, I'm gonna go over here and save my changes. And you can see that when I save these changes and I refresh, you can see that this now became uh, third. And you can also see how fast this does change which is uh, pretty nice. You can see how it customizes as you go. Now for what we're doing, uh, because we have it at most recent, and I'm not gonna mess things up, I'm gonna set it back to most recent. But you can also uh, do different ones that are pretty standard, like number of sales, average rating, etc. And so this is a nice way of customizing um, your page really without knowing much code or having to get much into the to code uh, like I might usually have to. Well, that concludes this tutorial on sorting products. Talk to you soon.